Well, good evening, Sir Hanlock. Steve, wishing you a very pleasant evening. And uh, here he is, Elon Musk, with the monkey that he's uh, brain-chipped and uh, now plays video games, apparently. Well, they obviously go to the same hairdresser. I mean, you know, you put a bow tie on that little monkey and, by golly, you've got a look-alike there, buddy. Oh, my goodness. No, just joking. I actually do like Elon Musk. Um, he's a little crazy, but, you know, at least he's thinking, at least he's speaking out, and um, at least he's entertaining. He's a very interesting chap, great mind, uh, goodness knows where it will lead to, but he certainly is not afraid to try new ideas. So, from Russia today, Elon Musk says his Neuralink startup has a brain chip monkey who plays video games. Elon Musk has claimed that one of his startup companies has a testing facility where a very happy lab monkey with a brain chip implant can play video games. Tesla and SpaceX CEO Elon Musk made the claim during a live stream for fans on the invitation-only conference app Clubhouse on Sunday evening, during which he spoke about his neurotechnology company Neuralink. We have a monkey with a wireless implant in their skull with tiny wires who can play video games with his mind, Musk claimed, adding, you can't see where the implant is, and he's a happy, happy monkey. Oh, goodness gracious. The world's richest man went on to claim that Neuralink has the nicest monkey facilities in the world. Hmm, the fur lined cages, uh, gold-plated bowls with food and water in them, and wants the monkeys to play mind pong with each other. Musk has previously compared the Neuralink chip to a Fitbit in your skull with tiny wires in reference to the popular smartwatches. Last year, Musk showed off several pigs which had the chips in their skulls, including one pig named Dorothy who had had the chip removed. What Dorothy illustrates is that you can put in the Neuralink, remove it, and be healthy, happy, and indistinguishable from a normal pig, Musk declared at the time. Well, I hope not to be indistinguishable from a normal pig. Video of the chip monkey will be released in about a month, Bloomberg reported. The billionaire's goal is for the technology to eventually be used by humans who could control devices like smartphones with their brain. On Twitter, Musk said that the short-term benefit would solve brain-spine injuries with the long-term potential being human AI symbiosis. And this is a tweet from Elon Musk. Please consider working at Neuralink. Short term, solve brain spine injuries. Long term, human AI symbiosis. Later will be species level important. Work at either our Bay Area or Austin locations. Musk's goal, however, has been dismissed by some critics, including one of the UK's top neurosurgeons, Dr. Henry Marsh, who called it fairy tales. I'm not saying it's impossible, but our present level of neuroscience and technology, there's no way we can do it, Marsh told RT in 2019. And, uh, well, let's hope this doesn't turn out like the latest SpaceX test launch and landing. So take a look at this uh, landing by the SpaceX test flight module and uh, you will see that not all things go exactly as planned. And uh, here we have the moment of liftoff. Everything's going well. Always impressed when I see a rocket like that take off. And uh, you can see they set up a camera on the side of the rocket looking back to Earth. Anyway, that's about it for about the next six minutes, and then we see the landing. And uh, here is the rocket coming in to land. seconds into flight we're down beneath one and a half kilometers we're preparing to restart two engines flip the vehicle vertical then transition to one engine for the landing burn oh my goodness what could go wrong 
There you go. So look out for a micro trip coming to a store near you. Maybe we can put them in ourselves. Maybe we'll just be able to poke them in our ears or something like that. Oh, I know what we can do. I've got a great idea. We can inject them with an inoculation. How does that sound? So I hope you enjoyed this article. And if you did, please like and subscribe. So I hope you enjoyed this article, and if you did, please like, comment, and subscribe below. And in the meantime, this is Hound Dog Steve signing off, wishing you a very pleasant evening, and we'll talk very, very shortly. You take care now. Bye.